directly, um, you know, I was speaking to, to Sean Carter and, and the NFL. You know, I felt like he really discredited Colin and myself and, and the work that's being done um, in our communities. And I think he could have handled the whole situation differently. You know, if he were to say, you know, I see the work that Colin and these guys have been doing, and I want to partner up with the league to further, um, you know, further that work, it had been totally different than some of the ways that he answered some of these questions. And so, yeah, I just felt like I needed to let people know that speaking to each other the way that we have been, is, it's not helping us get to any solution. We're not solving anything, and we've got to do a better job. So it's not necessarily about the fact that he didn't speak to Colin Kaepernick or yourself before joining that partnership. It was about the fact that his point of view was what next after Neely. Well, I mean, I could go, I mean, I, I can go on a list of, of things that I felt like uh, could have been done in a, in a, you know, or handled in a better fashion, and I, I really don't want to get into that. But for the most part, what I'm trying to say to people is that let's let's work towards solutions, and let's wait, let's wait and see what what goes down from this deal. Um, you can't really tell right now. It doesn't it doesn't uh, it doesn't sit right with me. I don't think that you know it was handled the right way, but you never know.